So y'all, I'm actually on my way to bed, but let's talk about this update with X-Men 97. Apparently, there is a supposed release date. Now, this is just a rumor, but this is coming out of Cosmic Circus, guys, and they're saying that X-Men 97 is going to premiere in early spring 2024. Now, on their site, it says, our sources have confirmed that Marvel Studios has decided on a spring release window for this new Marvel Disney Plus series. Our sources have told us that X-Men 97 Season 1 will premiere in mid to late March 2024. The show is confirmed to have 10 episodes releasing for the first season, and I think that's actually some new information as well, but this is going to follow up the iconic X-Men 90s animated series, and it unites new voice actors with a lot of original voice cast from the 90s animated version, so I am so hyped, guys. Magneto is going to be leading the X-Men this time due to some circumstance. I gotta go back and watch the show. I'm sure it's tied to the original series, but I'm excited for this, guys. The animation style looks great. When they revealed the animation, a few years ago and it still had that same old coat with the new sheen on the animation really I mean it looks a lot like the 90s animated but just updated and I love the look of it there were rumors swirling around that it would take on the what if look but that doesn't seem to be likely guys I am so excited for it cannot wait for X-Men 97 director Matthew Vaughn says that Deadpool 3 is gonna give MCU a jolt the jolt that it needs guys Matthew Vaughn sat with the bro bible post credit podcast where he talked about about his thoughts on Deadpool 3. And in the podcast, he says, a few snippets that I know about Deadpool, Deadpool versus Wolverine, or Wolverine versus Deadpool, I'm sure that argument between Ryan and Hugh is happening as we speak, are unbelievable. Now, this is a very interesting part here, he continued, that's going to be the jolt. The Marvel Universe is about to have a jolt of them, and it's going to bring that body back to life. I think Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman are about to save the whole Marvel Universe. That's so interesting, guys, because lately the MCU has been getting a lot of criticism for shows like Secret Invasion. Everybody didn't see eye to eye on the Marvels. There has been a lot of divisiveness with Marvel lately since after Endgame. And Matthew Vaughn is hinting here that Deadpool 3 could be what reels us back in and saves the MCU. Honestly, though, I don't think the MCU necessarily needs saving. I think there's been a few blunders here and there with Secret Invasion being the biggest one. But I don't think the MCU is absolutely in freak out panic mode yet. That's just my opinion. You guys let me know down in the comments. I don't know that it necessarily needs saving yet. And last but not least, guys, let's talk about this one. Kristen Ritter shared a post on Instagram. They have hinted at Jessica Jones coming back for Daredevil Born Again. With Daredevil Born Again right around the corner, I mean filming right now, and the MCU Netflix shows recently being announced as canon, seems like it might happen. But here in this post, Kristen Ritter shares a video of her in a shirt from the Jessica Jones series that she was wearing while in the show. Now, I love the sound of this guys i don't know that it's a hard confirmation that she'll be coming back but in the post she put if you know you know with eyeball emojis could that mean that she will end up back in the daredevil born again series i would love to see her and matt murdoch together again i actually think their dynamic was really really fun in defenders so i would love to see the two of them back together and of course these netflix shows i want all of them back iron fist i put a little asterisk i would love to see colleen wing be the iron fist this time but otherwise i want these shows back guys and having jessica jones and matt murdoch on screen together yet again taking on the streets guys i love the sound of this bring kristen ritter back because jessica jones especially season one phenomenal phenomenal season great show i would love to have her back and most of the other defenders as well you guys let me know your thoughts down in the comments about these stories how do you feel about jessica jones potentially returning do you think the mcu needs saving and how do you feel about matthew vine's comments on deadpool 3 and and last but not least, let us know how you're feeling about X-Men 97 and that release date being potentially right around the corner, y'all. Let us know your comments down. Let us know your thoughts down in the comments. And hey, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below for news on the MCU, DCU, and more. We'll see you next time on Geekly Goods.